I'm Jeff McComb from Boundary Ford, Lloyd Minster, bringing you this 2019 Chevy Blazer RS. Just a little over 50,000 kilometers. Beautiful looking machine. You'll notice there's a little bit of water droplets and stuff on there. I had to give it a quick rinse before this video. So if you have a look at the rims, they got a little bit of wax still on them from the getting the new tires installed here. So need a little bit better rinse on it but there's no markings no scraping you got one nope that's not even one little piece right here that's marked up on the driver's front rim there but you got brand new Yokohama's what are they Geolander XCV tires on this all the way around a couple little scrapes here this one actually feels like a bump so I think it could be cleaned off yeah it's coming off here by the finger so that could be cleaned off not much uh, for wear and tear on it there are a few rock chips here windshields in really good shape come around the front of the vehicle you're gonna have the odd little rock chip with 50,000 K there's one little one there all the plastic looks in really good shape the lenses here they got a few rock chips on them but uh, I shouldn't say rock chips but just a few little indents there everything's really good though rock chip there all the plastic on the front end everything's in really good shape it does have your uh, that's your little plug-in for your block block heater it's got 360 camera everything works good there up on the hood here you got a few little rock chips nothing dented but the paint's uh the paint's just chipped away a little bit there a little scratch right here another little rock chip there coming around this side nice little nice little chip right there other than that everything's looking pretty good a couple little spots here these rims don't look like they've been scratched up against anything. Just uh, the odd little rock chip. There's a rock chip here. This is a passenger side front tire. All the fenders look really good. No major rock chips. You are going to have a little bit. Being that uh, Chevy didn't put any mud flaps on the front. You're going to have a little bit of chips and dings in this bottom plastic. But... It looks pretty good for the most part. As you can see here, there's a little bit of a chip right there. A lot of this is just dirt from driving across the street. Hard to keep vehicles clean these days. One little scrape right here, it's not very deep nothing there so a little scrape here on this side come inside the driver passenger door here inside looks really good nice and clean it's got the upgraded Bose sound system in here you got your power passenger seat the foam and the leather all looks really good the RS trim line so it's got that red insert side of the center console here looks nice and clean no no major scratches or anything like that the odd little nick barely noticeable you got your glove box here getting a nice little glare off the sun here but glove box a little button right up here on the dash for your glove box nice and clean dash line it's got your full panoramic moonroof the covers closed right now we'll open that up Coming along the back here. A little bit of a mark right there. Not much for rock road rash or anything like that, but I don't know if you can really see that, but that isn't uh, up close if you get close. Just with this glossy black, there are a little few pebbling from the, uh, from the road from salt and sand and stuff like that come around this back tire rim looks really good there's no major markings in this rim 
come in the back seat here. Nice and clean back seat. Foam feels really good. A few little discolorations inside the, uh, the perforated seating there. Not much you can do about that. Can try to clean it out a little bit better. You got your uh, fold down cup holders here. Not sure if there's another one here or not. I'm not seeing it. You got your USB, USB-C, plus you got your household plug in there. Seats do uh, fold down. Nice little fold down seat there. I'm noticing a little bit of a scratch right here just by the back door. Not seeing anything else on this door. One little spot right here. Tiny little black spot. With this silver, there might be a few more scratches that are hard to see, just depending on the sunlight. Uh, silver hides that really well. One little mark. Oh, no, no marks over here. You got the mud flaps on the back here. Nice and clean back end. Like I said, Tried to clean her off as best I can. Windshield's good back here. Everything's looking really good back here. You got the nice dual exhaust on this RS line. All the plastic looks really good. I'm not sure if it has the trailer. It does have the trailer tow package in here. Nice little feature. See if I can do this one handed or not. We'll get that later. Power tailgate. Nice little uh, cargo system here. Looks like you can just press this down, slide her forward. Got a few different locking options on it. You can kind of hold your luggage wherever you want it for groceries, split them up. Nice little storage area here. You got your uh, spare tire, your jack. <coughs> Sorry about that. A little bit more storage up there as well. Come around here, it looks like you got, uh, oh, there you go. You can fold down the seats just like that with these little buttons here. Nice little system. Come around this side, everything's looking good. Just a little dusty here, but no major scratches or anything like that. Until I bend down and uh, there's one little marking right here. Looks like a little bit of a bump there. And then a little bit of paint transfer, white paint just on the edge here. Come around this side here. Rim looks really good. Looks like there might've been a little bit of a curb action right there. A little bit of a scrub on there as well as right up here. A little bit of a scrub. But everything looks really good. You got your fuel tank, capless fuel. Come in the back door here. This side looks really good. Door's nice and clean. Nice, easy one-handed up there. So you can slide this forward, giving you a little bit more storage. I'm not sure what you'd need that for, but there is that option. Everything's looking pretty good on this side for scratches. Not seeing too much. You are going to have a little bit of that pebbling and stuff just on the front here. There's a little bit of rock pebbling there. The odd little scratch here. Down this side, just on the black plastic. Nothing up on the silver door. We do got one little mark here. Looks like a, a parking lot little, as you can see, a parking lot door ding there. Other than that, it's nice and clean over here. Come in the driver's door. 
nice and clean no major markings one little mark right there might be able to be cleaned off you got your mirrors auto driver's window you got your programmable seats foam's nice and uh, firm here still nice and tight a little bit of discoloration there might be able to be cleaned out a little bit better nice and cool interior on these uh, Chevy Blazers we'll just fire this up so you got heated cooled seats here now your climate control you actually spin the uh, the outside ring of your vent here and as you can see the number goes up as you're spinning so nice cool little feature there and then same with the passenger side you just spin that for there your fan controls here plus you have your auto AC recirculate your different adjustments there your traction controls over here it does have built-in navigation Apple CarPlay Android Auto in here it's got the 360 camera we've got a few different viewing options that you can look at on here nice little feature stick that back in park so 50,791 kilometers on this uh, on this unit you got heated steering wheel here you got adaptive cruise control you got pre-collision assist you got auto high beams here on the on your turn signal switch loads of features beautiful looking machine open the sunroof up So that's vented and then all the way open oh it does go a little bit farther there you go nice little feature there we'll have her shut And we'll have a quick look underneath the hood here. While it's running. Nice clean little uh, little unit here. Everything appears to be running the way it should. So 3.6 liter V6. Twenty nineteen Chevy Blazer down here at Boundary Ford Lloydminster.